The fourth episode is a real turning point, titled The Choice of Failure. Here, Boss Lady Joe, rocked by Zoe Saldana, deals with a ton of problems as she's hunting terrorists like there's no tomorrow, connected to Aaliyah Hamrohai. This episode dives deep into Joe's emotional mess, totally messing up her mission. The Choice of Failure, the fourth episode, goes down in Long Island. Here, Cruz Manuelos hits the beach with Aaliyah Amrohai and her friends. As Cruz hangs out with Aaliyah and the gang, Joe and her crew keep an eye on them. At the same time, Joe hears about a total disaster of a mission by two cops involving CIA guy Kyle. This mission caused seven people to die, got on the national news, causing unwanted attention and maybe getting the operatives in trouble. This news ticks Joe off, but Kyle tells her he's got her teams back against any trouble from their bosses. In the meantime, Cruz gets super tight with Aaliyah, trying to suss out info about her life and her family. Aaliyah says that she's not into marriage, but her family's made her agree to marry Esan, a decision she can't fight. But, she likes Esan's nice guy vibe, unlike the future husbands of her friends. At the same time, Bobby, who's at the beach watching Joe, chats up Kamal who tries to flirt with her. So, Joe and her team gotta keep their distance and keep watching their marks from a nearby yacht. Meanwhile, Joe's teen daughter, Kate, gets in a car crash because her friend was driving like a maniac. She's rushed to the hospital where her dad, Neil, works. Neil gives Joe the lowdown, who promises him she'll be home by morning. During this time, CIA folks Caitlin Mead and Byron Westfield grill Kyle about the failed mission, making him spill the beans about the team. Kyle admits that he used the Lioness QRF team, landing them in trouble. But, he saves his own skin by saying his target can lead them to five big-time terrorists. This news calms down Caitlin, who later rings up Joe to plan a meeting to chat about her team's involvement in the Texas thing. Elsewhere, doctors tell Neil that Kate needs a dicey surgery and she's pregnant, but the baby's chances don't look good. Neil breaks this news to Joe, piling onto her problems. At the same time, Cruz keeps earning Aaliyah's trust and they head to a New York club for a wild night, but things go south, making Joe lose track of Cruz. As the episode wraps up, Joe tails Cruz into the club since there's no inside eyes and Bobby's been spotted by their targets. Joe walking into the club gets a guy's attention who later tries to flirt with Cruz. In the middle of a club fight, Aaliyah and her friends are made to bounce. At the same time, the guy drugs Cruz and drags her into the woods, trying to take advantage of her messed up state. This leads to Joe losing track of Cruz, and she's gotta find her. Luckily, Joe gets there in the nick of time to save Cruz from a nightmare. But, Cruz loses Aaliyah's group, causing problems for the mission. When they get to their safe house, Caitlin sees how messed up Cruz is and worries about her handling the mission. Besides losing contact with her target, carrying on with Joe's mission gets tricky. However, Joe persuades Caitlin that Cruz is doing alright when Aaliyah calls to check on Cruz. On top of that, Cruz spills that Aaliyah's planning to have the wedding in the UAE, where both the CIA and the Lioness squad can have their back. This wedding will pull in top-ranking targets tied to Aaliyah's family, making chances for Joe's mission to work. However, Joe's got to take care of her personal stuff, flying back home to handle her family drama. There's also the hanging threat of big-time trouble for her team from the CIA due to their involvement in Kyle's botched mission. These distractions could screw up Cruz's mission. 